morning guys this is our first spot in the morning today and we have made it to seven sleepers it's almost 50 minutes to an hour drive from Izmir so yesterday night we stayed at Izmir and today morning after breakfast we drove to seven sleepers this is our first spot after this we'll be heading to Ephesus ruins So guys, this thing behind me is it's the Church of the Seven Sleepers. As you can see inside, it's closed as of now because uh, it has the danger of being torn apart or you know fall on the ground. So that's why they have closed it. But it has a good history, and I'll tell you in my other part that what's the history behind it. That's our first stop of Ephesus. Let me show you where we are now. You see the number four. This is the place where we are now. By the way, my name is Darvish, but not the wordy one. Nice I'm to meet you. One. Yeah. Your name? Akshat. Aprajita. Aprajita. Akshat. Okay. You see the number four. This is the place where we are now. It is called ticket office. Okay. But the original gate of Ephesus start from the bottom side. 150, 200 meters farther from us. It is called the gate of Magnesia. So we are going to visit typically Greek, a Roman city. The city which was constructed, which was built about 3rd century before Christ by Lysimachus. Lysimachus was one of the generals of Alexander the Great. And the city which we are going to visit now is known as the third location of Ephesus. Which means the city of Ephesus changed its location for more than three times. For four different times of Ephesus. We will see more than 35-40 sections. This city was constructed by Lysimachus, who was one of the generals of Alexander the Great. Mm. It is believed that when just he moved second Ephesus to here, he ordered to build harbor at the bottom. You oh. see the place where was the yeah. harbor located? And he ordered to build city wall, which was nine kilometer long one. And every 35 meters of the city wall, they had watch towers to make the own city more defensible. Mm -hmm. And the name Caesar Augustus said, when I kept Rome, ladies and gentlemen, everything with bricks, and I left Rome with marble. Later on, we will see 14, 14 times bigger than this one at the bottom, mm -hmm. oh. where where one of the Indian movies was shot. Maybe you heard about Farhan actor, yeah. Bianca Chopra. Yeah. Yeah, I'm talking about Dil Darak Nedo. Yeah. All original steps which date back to second century after Christ, 100 percent white marble. They were made out of. Fourteen times bigger than this one at the bottom. Okay. So this theater had double functions and it was with capacity of fourteen thousand. This one? Thousand four hundred. Huh? Fourteen thousand? It was fourteen hundred. Fourteen hundred. Okay. When I said fourteen thousand, <laughs> yeah, fourteen thousand is too much. Thousand four hundred. Yeah. Fourteen hundred. Capacity? Fourteen hundred. <laughs> Goddess, her name is yeah. Nike. 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 The winged goddess of victories and goddess of shoe company Nike. <laughs> <laughs> it is believed that when she got fly to the sky to bring victory from the sky, her skirt got triple Nike and logo, Nike thick. Come please. Oh. Oh. Where Nike swish came from. Oh. And most probably it was taken by American shoe company after 1972 or 3. Oh. She had a sister, her name was Taiki. Taiki? Nike was girls of victories, Roman name Victoria. Taiki was girls of good life, Roman name was Fortuna Fortune. And on the right side, you see ladies back to back. Those are the Amazons. Right behind the Amazons, 
dio noises. There are so many cats here. Now we have uh, 200 cats. Yeah. This was the toilet system? Yeah. Latrine. Hmm? Latrine. Latrine? Yeah. Uh, it is called latrine or public loo. Yeah. Well, it is called library of salsas. Who was salsas? Of course, not about the Greece. Not related to temperature. He was one of the gentlemen who was sent here as a governor. And most probably, he's and it was the third biggest library of the ancient world. The first one in Alexandria, second one Pergamon, and third one here, with 12,000 books. I'm part of the House of Librarians, and on the right side you see the Triple Arch Gate, which was opening the slave market, commercial agora. Kind of commercial agora, or daily shopping area, or grand bazaar you may call. All around was surrounded by the shops. They had more than 120 shops here. As you can see in the distance is the Ephesus library. It's funny that men used to go to the library more than the women in that era. But do you know the real hidden secret behind that? It is because there was a secret entrance from the library to the house of pleasure. And there is a sign where you can just confirm the same. So in this you can see on the right hand was a depiction of a queen which says I'm a lady and I'm a queen and in this foot you can see only those men were allowed to enter which have and can fit in this foot so if your fit foot is smaller than this then that means you are younger you cannot enter the same and if you have a broken heart and the your foot size of these then you can drop a coin here and you can enter to the house of pleasure this is how it works interesting huh so this was the pathway which connected the city with the harbor according to the tour guide and the local if they had any disease or any kind of skin problems they would not be allowed to enter this pathway into the city just they would be sent back as we walk past the harbor passage you can see behind me the Ephesus theater it almost occupies and has an occupancy of around 20 25,000 people so if you want to know the population of the city just multiply it by 10 so it occupies just one tenth of the population of the city. It had two entrances for the theater. Believe it or not, this was the fighting club for the gladiators. 
and the stage was made high enough so that the audience didn't get distracted with the amazing spectacular view of the harbor and this pit was covered and put on fire so that the animals fighting in the pit didn't cross and attack the audience Look at the ruins that are found after the excavation. Bye. 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 Bye.